Railways continued their sheer dominance in the senior T20 trophy as they were crowned as the champions. We witnessed quite a few impressive performances both with the bat and the ball. So who are the top three uncapped players who had a very good run in this tournament and a lot of hopes will be pinned on them if at all they get an opportunity to play in the upcoming women's T20 challenge? Let's have a look. Well, I promise you just cannot skip the name of Kiran Navkire. Nagaland had a very good tournament wherein they won all their six matches in the plate group and the one player who helped them to grab victory with her consistency with the bat is Kiran Navkire. In the first match of Nagaland, she registered the highest individual score in T20s and then continued her good form in the tournament. She finished as the highest run-getter of this tournament with 525 runs to her account. Opening the innings for Nagaland, we saw some attacking game from her and her six-hitting abilities also grabbed a lot of attention. She's definitely one exciting talent to watch out for. Now, let's just head on to the bowling. Well, Maya Sunaune is the one name that will strike our minds. Playing for Maharashtra, she kind in with some important wickets for the team. She registered two consecutive four-wicket hauls. The first one came against Andhra Pradesh and then against Bihar. In the finals, where Maharashtra faced railways, Maya Sonavne picked up two important wickets. One was that of Nuzhat Parveen and the other of the informed Dayalan Hemlata. Both these wickets were important and Maharashtra was in need of wickets and Maya Sonavne, the spinner, stood for the team. With her performances in the senior T20 trophy, definitely people would want to see more of her in the upcoming days. Well, now let's talk about the pacer Sujata Malik. Odisha also had a very good run in this tournament wherein they eventually reached the semis but facing railways they couldn't make it to the finals but the journey was important for them and one player who helped them in their journey is Sujata Malik. She finished with 11 wickets in this tournament and also maintained a very healthy economy rate throughout this tournament. She also picked up 4 wickets against Bihar in this tournament. Well, these are the three uncapped players who had a very good tournament. We'll also discuss about the three capped players who had a good run in this tournament in the next video. So stay tuned to Women's Quick Zone for all the updates.